Hello and welcome to your October 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. You're watching Thomas's Tower Reading. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now, October 2022 is a powerful month for all signs because in the origin story of the shamanic tribes, we come from the stars and we come from a place called the Pleiades. And the moon, all right, the moon is what governs our emotions. And between the 12th and the 14th of October, the moon sits right underneath the Pleiades, which means emotionally speaking, mid months, we all will connect <coughs> excuse me, to who we truly are. So you will be much more empowered mid-months. The point is, don't just wait for, for, for this little window <laughs> to make good choices, okay? So, Cancerians, let's dive right in. What we will do, we look at the overall energy for the months ahead. Before we then look into your emotional core, uh, see what can go, see what can come. Um, and... Um, then we will look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the months of October 2022. Now, <clears throat> when it comes to the overall energy for the months, your energy, Cancerians, does not feel very high. And what you're being asked, <clears throat> excuse me, is <coughs> sometimes in the morning my asthma is really bad. Seems to be one of those times. You're asked to have courage. Right? Don't just live a life you're not happy with. Don't live a life you're not content with. Be courageous. Right? Have courage to claim your space. Be who you are and claim your position in life. Okay? It feels to me that that could be a bit fictitious. Right? So choose your battles. Sometimes when you claim your space, you just tell people what's what, if that makes sense. Right? I'm also getting really fear, really weird things. So obviously this is a general reading, so I know it doesn't, doesn't resonate with all of you. But I'm getting this um, about uh, relationships. So if you're in a relationship with someone and there are things that clearly aren't working, don't have the conversation in your own home. Uh, the way this is shown to me is, um, you know, Dress up, go out for something that would that would uh, look like a date. <laughs> go to a restaurant, and while you're having a, a a lovely dinner, right, and energies are harmonious, that's when you then say, "By the way, I brought you here to talk about why I'm not happy or where I'm not happy." Um, so what I'm feeling is, don't don't let shit come to you. <clears throat> and don't have it in your own house. And if you do have it in your own house, make sure you cleanse. Really, really important. But you are asked to be courageous. You are asked to acknowledge and address what isn't working, Cancerians, right? So, <coughs> when it then comes to your emotional core, uh, you know, uh, what can heal, uh, is love coming in, all that kind of stuff, we already talked about it here with the over energy, what you have is um, the energy of community, right? Don't go it alone. Talk to talk to people. Reach out. Have a coffee. You know, um, join the library on the mornings you don't work, right? Just meet different people. Talk about different things, if that makes sense, right? So now we're moving on to the area of opportunities and opportunities as they present themselves to you in the months of October. Come with the term fulfillment. Fulfillment. And what that means is, it is not important how numerous opportunities are. It is only important that you manifest what really is you. Right? So, if you're not well financially, manifesting a new job without manifesting the, the feeling of, I want to belong somewhere, and that it pays is sort of coincidental almost. Don't just do what what pays the bill because you're too deep. 
right? The, you feel everything. So it's pointless to just be part of a, of a group of idiots that get paid by someone else. <clears throat> so with regards to opportunities then in the month of October 2022, this is more important to realize there's a job offer and then you reflect and you can see like, okay, better pay, shitty hours, not sure I get home in the evening, all that kind of stuff. Is it then worth having? Would you advise your best friend to do that to do that job? Right? So disregard the circumstances you find yourself in and ask yourself under normal circumstances, would I actually engage in being somewhere trapped for eight hours? This is then how you realize, oh, I wouldn't. And then you manifest anew because you will you are you are more than entitled to feel happy wherever you are. And because we're talking about opportunities and therefore what's, what sustains you financially, wouldn't it make sense to be somewhere where you really feel like you're, you're, you're home and you get paid while you're home? Right, that kind of thing. Really, really important. Anyway, <coughs> Cancerians, that is your, or that was your October 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium thomas. See you next month. Bye-bye.